What's up guys, Jason here with feelawesomecompany.com and in this video I'm going to go over the benefits of zinc for your testosterone, HGH, and IGF-1. But before I jump into the video, if it's your first time here, this channel is all about health, nutrition, supplementation, and everything to help you feel awesome. And if that sounds good to you, consider going down, subscribing to the channel, then also turn on the bell notification so you don't miss anything. And so, now the first thing I want to talk about is zinc and testosterone. And the first thing I want to cover is that if you have a zinc deficiency, your testosterone levels are going to be lower than where they could be. And working to correct that deficiency will uh, definitely help to uh, raise your testosterone. Now, the amount of test or the amount of uh, zinc you need varies from person to person and it's going to be i mean anywhere from like 10 milligrams per day up to about 40 milligrams per day is a good range to uh, try to shoot for and you can get that either from food or supplementation and so when it comes to uh, zinc's effects on testosterone it really has a few different effects and so the first thing i want to cover is it's not 100% fully understood or confirmed yet, but there is uh, research uh, showing that zinc may affect the cells uh, in the testes that produce testosterone, which if that's true, then zinc will play a direct role in helping to increase your testosterone levels up, can help support your energy, muscle mass, a libido, and all the good things that testosterone can do. Now, the next two uh, ways that zinc affects tes uh, testosterone are fully researched, uh, they're known, and they've been proven. And so the first thing is that zinc inhibits the enzyme that converts testosterone into DHT. And with that, what it's going to do, it's not going to increase your testosterone levels per se, but it's going to take the testosterone you already have produced and just hold on to it longer before uh, before it gets converted or broken down into anything else. So it's going to keep your uh, testosterone up, and that's also going to lower and keep your level of DHT, uh, DHT down, which is also very beneficial. You do want some uh, DHT, but if you have really high levels of it, it can cause things like uh, hair loss, an enlarged prostate, prostate cancer, and a lot of other uh, just kind of negative uh, side effects. So you want to keep your uh, DHT lower and your testosterone higher. Now, another way that zinc affects your uh, testosterone is that it also it acts as an aromatase inhibitor which aromatase is another enzyme and it is uh, responsible for converting testosterone into estrogen. So by inhibiting that, you really get two different benefits. One, you're gonna hold on to your testosterone longer and keep it elevated higher, but it's also gonna keep your estrogen levels lower, which, you know, if you can keep your estrogen lower, that's gonna benefit your testosterone. And if your estrogen starts to raise up and get too high, your testosterone's going to drop uh, because of it. So just helping to inhibit this enzyme is incredibly important and can provide a lot of benefits for your testosterone levels. Now, besides zinc's effects on testosterone, it does also uh, affect some other uh, key hormones. And so when you have uh, sufficient levels of zinc within your body, this will also help to uh, optimize uh, human growth hormone secretion, HGH, as well as improving uh, growth hormone uh, receptors, and uh, which really just kind of helps to make the uh, HGH that you produce, uh, it, it helps it to be more efficient within the body and you get better results from it. And then besides that, uh, zinc also helps to increase uh, circulating IGF-1 uh, concentrations, which uh, plays a big role in helping you to uh, build muscle mass. And so by supporting those uh, different hormones, 
it's really good for uh, just your overall health also your ability to uh, heal and repair as well as your uh, body composition and muscle mass plus a lot of other different things so really important zinc can help with a lot of very important hormones especially for men and as far as getting zinc uh, you can get it either through your diet or through supplementation and if you want to try to get it uh, through your diet, some really good uh, food sources of zinc include things like oysters, uh, grass-fed beef, and pumpkin seeds. Along with, there's a lot of other foods that contain zinc as well. It's just those three are really good sources of it. Or if you're not really into any of those foods or you just want the uh, convenience of a supplement, you can do that as well. Research shows that uh, zinc supplementation is also incredibly beneficial. And I will uh, link to a quality supplement down below. Now, if you want to learn more about the uh, benefits of zinc, uh, specifically for men, I have a whole nother video on this topic, and I will link to it uh, down in the description. And then I will also put it up here in the end card for you. And if you enjoyed this video and uh, want to see more content just like this, make sure you to subscribe to the channel and so that way I will see you in the next video. Peace.